because he is openly slimy. At first, he isn't that bad. He is a noble but poor and his family lowborn. Because his father fought well for and befriended Hoster Tully he ends up being fostered by the respectable house. He is teased growing up by Ed Muir for his small stature and low birth, hence the name Little Finger. He was smitten with Caitlin Tully but she didn't reciprocate his feelings, she saw him as a brother, when her betrothal to Brandon Stark was announced, Little Finger danced with and tried to kiss Caitlin but she rejected him. He got drunk and Lisa, Caitlin's sister, who had always been in love with him climbed into his bed and her took her virginity or maiden head. He drunkly thought it was Caitlin, and may still. Hello everyone, if you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any new updates on your favorite TV series. When the date for the wedding of Caitlin Tully and Brandon Stark was announced, Littlefinger challenged him to a duel. His life was spared due to Caitlin's request. He was severely wounded physically and emotionally. During the next two weeks Lisa nursed him and again had sex with him. Hoster Tully sent him away because of his behavior, Lisa revealed she was pregnant in hopes her father would let her marry Peter, he refused on the basis that Peter was too lowborn. It's unclear if Peter knew at the time that she was pregnant with his child, she would tell him later, but likely she was just a notch for him. Hoster Tully made her have an abortion using moon tea, she drank it not knowing what it was, and married her to Jonaran who was much older but needed a fertile wife to bear him an heir. They married at the beginning of Robert's Rebellion, the same time as Caitlin slash Ned Stark. Afterwards Jonaran was named Hand of the King therefore he and Lisa lived in King's Landing. Lisa convinced John to name him to a position of customs, he did well and rose to Master of Coin on King Robert's small council. During this time Lisa and Peter begin an affair. Lisa had several miscarriages and stillbirths, making her paranoid about her only son, Robin slash Robert. John was concerned about his only living heir growing up too weak and planned to foster him on Dragonstone with Stannis Baratheon. Lisa became furious and Littlefinger gave her the idea to poison John with the tears of Lys, to make his death appear natural, and tell Caitlin Stark the Lannisters were to blame. He also forms a network of spies, high-priced brothels in King's Landing, and borrows money, keeping double books, from the Iron Bank to keep the crown supplied with money. It is through his network he learns information. This is how he learns Caitlin has come to King's Landing, to learn more about the attempted assassination of her son. Peter lies to her when she shows him the dagger used in the attempt, claiming he lost it in a bet to Tyrion Lannister when he really lost it in a bet to King Robert, which Joffrey later stole and gave to a hired killer. Littlefinger feigns friendship with Ned, promising to help him find Jonaran's killer. He tells Ned he will convince the City Watch to back Ned but betrays him to the Lannisters after Ned is named as regent by King Robert on his deathbed. He takes Ned Stark's bones back to Caitlin, she knows he betrayed Ned, lies to her about the Lannisters having Arya, then tries to hit on her. He also gives her the idea, originally Tyrion's, to trade Jaime Lannister for Sansa and Arya. Thanks for watching, please don't forget to like this video and drop comments, and most importantly don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything.